time once more for another daily. And once again we're inside because I've left it too late. So we had another staff meeting today and we've actually got another one tomorrow. Um, these things are usually supposed to be monthly but now we're having them weekly and now twice in one week. So with the virus and everything that's going on, um, I've done a lot more sort of research into it and I've had a lot more information just given to me this morning um, and that has actually changed my attitude about it quite completely um, and if you're interested I would go and do your own research into it um, but one of the big issues I have with where I work is we're one of only two places in the entire country that produce uh, medical grade um, gases like oxygen, uh, nitrous oxide, air, all that sort of things for hospitals and medical centres. So if everything goes horribly pear-shaped and everything goes into lockdown uh, like it has in Italy and a few other countries I believe, um, I've still got to go to work um, because that's the job. So we're classified as um, sort of very uh, as high priority essential service uh, sort of like food and petrol and that sort of things because we supply hospitals and the way it was put to me is if I get sick and I can't do my job or if I get other people at work sick and they can't do their job and we can't supply um, what we do then there's a high chance people will die um, because of the symptoms of this virus and the complications because of it oxygen's in very heavy demand so that was quite sobering so now I'm actually taking a lot more precautions than what I would have normally so I'm like the opposite to a germaphobe so for me it's quite a contrast but it is what it is and as I said we have another meeting tomorrow so we'll see what happens there um, that's all I've got time for so thanks for watching and stay tuned I will probably do I might actually do an actual video just my thoughts and opinions on this virus but I might not either way thanks for watching